This section of building once held eight apartments. Now it holds four. The Etheridge family occupies the second floor. Plenty of cabin space. Sergeant Plenty. First Class Harvey Etheridge and his wife Calandra have lived there a little over a month with their four daughters. This day, three are in school, leaving three-year-old Shamara plenty of space to work on the computer while mom and dad talk about their five-bedroom home. I like the fact that, you know, we have separate living room and dining room areas now. Kitchen is big enough for the family to, you know, cook meals together instead of separately. You know, um, the bedrooms are a lot bigger to accommodate the um, bedding that my children have. The 2,200-square-foot home is much larger than what the Etheridges are used to from on-post housing. Now, every daughter gets her own room. Uh, they love the fact that her having her own space, mainly India, my 11-year-old, because unfortunately, when we was over at Panzer, um, they had to share a room. So when she doesn't want to go to sleep, India don't have to hear her cry herself to sleep. So, so she, she appreciates that a lot. The Etheridges live on Kelly Barracks, where three out of seven buildings have been converted to accommodate large families. On nearby Post Robinson Barracks, the housing office has seven newly renovated units. Housing officials expect building renovations on Kelly to finish up in April, meaning more space for more families like the Etheridges. Being uh, that we are a family of six, we have plenty of closet space for clothes. I have five girls, so you can imagine the clothes and the shoes that's going on around here, so I need that space bad. We also have master bath, which is great and convenient, so you have to run to the other end of the room in the middle of the night, if you will. The extra room also makes the unpacking process a little bit easier. Daniel Day, Stuttgart, Germany.